feel like this is a, sp a suspicious area. Yep. What? What? Oh! Oh! What's up, my dudes? How's it going today? Dak Blake here. Today, we're playing the new Bouncy Bear game. That's right. Have you ever wanted to play Garden of Ban Ban, but make all of the characters bears? Wait, yeah? Wait, really? That's very specific of you. Why did you want that? <laughs> well, do I have the game for you? The Maze of Bouncy Bear. We are playing, I think this is the fourth game. I played one and two and I didn't do three, but hey, today we're about to have some fun. We're about to break the game and we're gonna see what this is all about. I'm excited because this is by That Nerd Punk and we've played a, a lot of the other games of that, that Nerd Punk has made. So I think this is gonna be really cool. It's obviously inspired by Garden of Ban Ban. So sit back, relax, grab some food, I guess. Here, I have a like a half eaten bag of chips. Do you want? Oh, no. I mean, I thought I'd ask. Okay, fine. You have your own food? It's, pro it's probably better. <laughs> All right, well, let's jump into this. All right, so I loaded the game up. I think, like, what's confusing is I tried to click play, but it made me click chapter one, which makes me think, like, is, this, is there three chapters to this game, or am I playing the old game of chapter one? I don't know. I'm confused, but I'm excited. Okay, well, we got a bounce bear right there. Uh, what do we got? This is Bouncy Bear and Mr. Mon's Family Diner. I'm ready to have some food, to dance, or anything. I don't know, it's always abandoned, huh? It sounds like there's people over here. Wait, I can't, I can't walk forward. Are there people over there? Wait, you guys having a party and I'm not invited? There's an invisible wall here, I can't do anything. That's kind of like a mean element to the game. They're like, hey. There's a party going on over here, but you're not allowed. We put up an invisible wall so you can hear them. <laughs> but you can't go over there. <laughs> All right, fine. I see how it is. So what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to click the big red button? Probably. There we go. All right. So we are beginning our journey today with him. Oh, man. Hey. <laughs> Hi there. So that's Bouncy Bear, obviously. Can you give me a hug? Can we be friends? Uh, do we have to attack him? Like, what is the, the goal here? Okay, so the first thing I always want to do is I want to lose. I want to run into the monster, <laughs> which is never what normal people want to do, but I'm, I'm different. I want, I want to lose now. Come on. What is this? I, I see there's like, oh, a basket here. Am I supposed to put things here? Uh, welcome to class, everybody. Today, we are going to be talking about baskets. Um, uh, article number one, a basket. There you go. You have now seen it. Thank you everybody for joining me today. <laughs> Woo! All right, so far I am a little confused. I don't know what I'm doing or what I'm chasing, but it seems like things are different now. Wait, hold on. This whole side is different than it was before. Okay, there's a real microphone up on the floor. All right, all right, and then this. Yesterday I heard my mom. Oh wait, hold on. A kid wrote this. So yesterday I heard my mom calling from the maze. I got in, but I found Funny Blue Bear instead. <laughs> now he is my best friend. Description: A drawing made by a child. Bouncy Bear probably lured him using his mother's voice. Whoa! So Bouncy Bear got in incredibly creepy. I thought he was just a monster, but no, he's like a like a trickery monster. You know what's weird though? I mean, why do all of the like kids think that this giant scary blue bear is a friend? It's like in all of these games, they're like, I love Huggy Wuggy. I don't care about his super sharp teeth or his scary height. I like that. All right, all right. So, what do we do here? <laughs> I'm a looking for the secrets. I think I have to do this, right? Boom. Ooh, nice! Okay, so <laughs> the first thing I've noticed as well about this game is there are super like loud electrical lights uh, throughout the thing. Like, do you hear this? That's so loud. Like, what is going on with the electricity here? Is Bouncy Bear absorbing everything? It does seem that he is kind of like, he's kind of like a, like a, an animatronic almost now. So it's like we've combined Garden of Ban Ban with Five Nights at Freddy's almost. All right, but I, <laughs> I want to get caught by that new character. Who are you? Hello? I can't see anything. I, it is just completely dark. Do I run backwards? I think, maybe. I don't think this is the right thing to do. Uh, you know, number one rule about horror games is you don't run backwards into dark rooms. I feel like I could find a glitch here. Oh, 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 oh gosh, what is that? I, I think I could glitch the game out to make like my legs break into the wall. Oh my gosh, do you hear that? It's like, grrr, my leg is just going through the wall. Hold on one more time, uh, just, oh, ow. 
That just, that sounds painful. All right, glitch number one, check. I broke my legs. It's also funny because in real life, I am prone to breaking all of my bones. <laughs> if you don't know, I have broken my arm, my other arm, my hand, my nose, and my pinky. Uh, I am fragile. <laughs> oh, what is this? Uh, it's a locked door. Okay, um, hello? Can I leave? Hello? <laughs> I'm just waiting for the day <laughs> that a game actually is listening to my voice and it answers back. Hey, can you stop yelling in all of my hallways? You're being annoying. <laughs> all right, I guess I just gotta keep running. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. It doesn't feel like I'm in any danger. Come on, where's the danger? I'm gonna run towards the danger. I do not see anything. Wait, I saw an arrow. Maybe this is where I'm supposed to go? Go here. <laughs> all right. Oh, here's the key. Oh, and it says fragile. Hey, this is me. <laughs> so I've made it to an area that gives me the option to interact. It seems like wood on the wall. I don't <laughs> I don't know why I can't just like duck under it. it. There's just two pieces of wood here, but I think I need to take this key, bring it back and then get like a crowbar or something. It's kind of like Hello Neighbor vibes. Also, I want to play Hello Neighbor again. That sounds fun. All right, let's open this up. Boom, magical key. Uh, and a weird apartment area. We got ourselves a TV, a couch that's in the ground, a giant refrigerator. I could probably, I could fit in this refrigerator and not even like, it wouldn't even be cramped. Can I open anything? It feels like I could just move in here. <laughs> what if, <laughs> it feels like Bouncy Bear is supposed to be like this scary maze that you go through. But what if Bouncy Bear just sees me sitting down watching TV? He just walks up, he's like, hey, you're supposed to be scared. And I'm like, hey, I moved in. <laughs> We're roommates. I'm like, this TV has no channels though. Um, Yeah, here we go. Got a hammer. Oh, is it a ball? Uh, are we playing? Hello? You want a ball? Was that always there? Did I just skip past that? Well, I'm I'm kicking the ball now. I feel like I can't focus. I gotta I gotta take the ball with me. I'm gonna call this ball Barth Barth Baltholomew Baltholomew. <laughs> All right, this is Baltholomew. He is no, he's stuck in the corner. Oh wait, no, he's good. He's good. All right, here we go. I, I thought I was gonna lose him right away. All right, me and Baltholomew, we are uh we are making our way out of here. We're gonna we're gonna survive. All right, I'm kind of getting lost because I keep trying to move the ball. Uh, hold on, maybe I just, I, I figure out where I'm going first, right? All right, I think it's this way. Um, yep, 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 okay. Bartholomew, go this way. And then we have this and this, uh, weirdly still blocking everything. What, what, what am I supposed to, oh, there we go. All right, Bartholomew, come with me. All right, here we go, button. Woo, what is this? What does this mean? Hello? All right, don't be scared, Bartholomew. We got this. I, I just hear doors opening like crazy. All right, it feels like this way. Um, oh, we got a lot of TVs here. Wait, wait, where? Oh, okay, Bartholomew walk forward. I was like, wait, where is he? All right, Bartholomew, you keep watch, all right? I'm gonna read. To the one who may find this, trapped under constant gaze, cameras bind me, a silent plea for escape. Seek the truth beyond these lens, break the chains of surveillance, your discovery could set me free. Um, it was written by a security officer that was apparently being under slavery. Uh, so what are we supposed to do with all this then? Cameras bind me. Are we supposed to find like, like, like chains on a camera? All right, we're moving forward. We found what looks like an indoor park here. Okay, Bartholomew, go have some fun. All right, what is this? Uh, okay. <laughs> it was just a picture of Yo-Yo Yeti. Like, ah, ah. Okay, it says nine. All right, am I supposed to know a code here? Oh, Bartholomew found one. All right, thank you. Uh, two. Okay, I don't, okay, wait, it says number two. Was I supposed to keep track? Oh no, oh no, I didn't remember. It didn't say on the top what it was. Oh no, 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 I kinda, I also forgot the number. It was it nine, nine maybe? Uh, what was this one? <laughs> I feel like I'm so forgetful. There really can't be like, okay, number one is four. So four, two, uh, maybe? What's this one? Four, two, seven, nine then? See, what if I forgot? Uh, all, all right, uh, hold on. Four, two, seven, nine. Continue. Woo, okay, I am very glad I paid attention. Thank you, Bartholomew, or Bartholomew, let's go forward. All right, well, there's my ball. I feel like this is a, sp a suspicious area. Yep, what, what? Oh, oh, what? How was I supposed to know? Was I supposed to run? 
Was I supposed to run? Did I just lose? All right, I replayed through the whole game just to test it. So I'm just gonna run forward now. All right, three, two, one, go! Okay, so if I just run, can I win? Oh, I can, right? Oh, okay. All right, well, this is way different than what I expected. I honestly was like, oh, maybe it's just gonna force me to stop, but here we go. Um, all right, I think we just, we win, we win. Wait, wait. <laughs> It was literally like 10 more seconds of gameplay. <laughs> so then what happens if I click chapter two? What happens? I, ca I can't. It is only chapter one. Hold on, I'm still so confused. What is going on over here? They really just have a party back there? I see there's no party. It looks like a light machine. That's it. <laughs> what? It's radio call maze is that what or is that what it is this way okay but i think that's probably like another chapter so i'm a little confused i think that i am mike's dad and mike is my son right so like is this so this is my son's birthday party did no one show up did i like place these hats here and i'm like oh man i hope people are coming or did like they already go into the maze and like then my son got taken and i'm supposed to chase after I can't really remember. I do remember in like the first game, I was like, man, the sun is bright outside. I do have to say though, throughout the course of this, um, of these like playthroughs, like that nerd punk has gotten incredibly good at making games. I think that this is an incredible improvement. And as, as much like as this game, you know, is inspired by like Garden of Bandman and stuff, it does have incredible, like unique elements of the maze and stuff. I can't wait to see like an, like a totally new concept from uh, that nerd punk. And I think there might be uh, some games that he's already made, but I, I think that's it. There's nothing else to really play here. I beat everything. I think I may have found all the secrets. I do know that there are secret endings, but I'm not sure. I, right now I've skipped ahead to, to see if we can find the secret ending. And I think that this is just where the character hides. So there's nothing over here. And I wonder if there are different areas to even go. And no, I just looked at everything. I literally went in every single corner right now. I don't think there's anything else. But yeah, this is a pretty fun game. You know, the guard to ban ban turned into bears. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it there. Hopefully it made you smile. Just a chill fun time today. And hopefully I can make you smile every single day. We have some new stuff this week as well. We're trying like a bunch of crazy new mods. We just did Joyville with the flood mod. And then we're gonna probably try to do something a little bit crazy with Garden to Ban Ban and Choo Choo Trials, so hey, maybe. But hey, thank you for subscribing and joining the DAC Bag. And as we go towards 3 million subscribers, I thank God every day I'm able to do these things. I'm just so happy to be able to make you smile. And I hope I can do that in the next episode. Probably coming up right now. I'll see you there. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, peace out, my dudes.